when you have a lot of fruit trees, your worst enemies are rabbits and mice and rats, basically any little creature that will want to gnaw on the bark of your fruit tree, especially during the winter when they're most desperate for nourishment. Now, um, the problem is they can gnaw off, they can do a lot of damage. They can gnaw off the bark all the way around the tree and kill your fruit trees. So we need to wrap something around the trunk to keep it protected. But when we wrap a tree trunk, we also need to have it breathable. So it needs to be able to protect the tree trunk, but it also the material needs to be breathable. So uh, the, 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 the the bark underneath it does not rot, does not develop fungus. So this time I'm going to be using, uh, this is fiberglass mesh. This is the same material that they use to make window screens. This is actually, I bought a 100 foot roll that is eight inches wide and they use this specifically to cover up vents to keep insects out of venting. But uh, I think this will work out perfectly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna cut it into two and a half foot lengths. Generally, when they say you wrap tree trunks, you want to go from anywhere from 18 inches to a full three feet, 36 inches. And that's because the little critters can stand on top of the snow and get higher up on the tree trunk than you than you might realize. It all depends on how much snow that you get. But I'm going to do two and a half feet just so I can maximize the use of this 100 foot roll. I'm going to be attaching it to the tree with galvanized steel wire. This is 24 gauge, just whatever works for you. You can use zip ties as well. Got my pliers. So it's time to get out there and protect my trees.